Oh, from this to that. Bro, the jump is massive. <laughs> I'm Kramas Found, as known on Instagram. I'm based in Lebanon, and um, I found my passion like uh, for video editing like one, two years ago. I started with Photoshop and got my way up to CapCut and Premiere Pro. And then I found about your channel and uh, your that speed ramp itself. And then that's how I started that type of edit. Dope, man, that's so sick. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, I, I, I don't know where I found you, but I saw some of your videos on my feed. Yeah, I, then... I DM'd you on Discord, I guess. That was it, that was it. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, I saw you I on I sent the... you the link, yeah. Yeah, that was sick, exactly. bro. I love that, I love that. Yeah. When did you start actually editing car videos? I remember buying a course, like that's when I started that type. But I started like two years ago in CapCut and Premiere Pro. Oh wait, you were, you were in CapCut first and then you moved to Premiere? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Tell me about that. CapCut was easy, but not that result. So you won't get that results about it and it's just basic stuff and the most important thing about CapCut for me was the shapes they were like so easy to use and that stuff and yeah. I used to edit football stuff yeah because CapCut is kind of like plug and play you can easily just throw exactly. things in and you get whereas in Premiere Pro After Effects you have to keyframe things yourself and whatnot yeah right? exactly Awesome, bro. And so exactly. do you only edit so, on Premiere or yeah. do you edit on After Effects? I started with Premiere Pro because it's like more basic and After Effects was so advanced. Like when I opened it, it was so complicated and stuff. And the UI system of Photoshop and Premiere Pro and learning Photoshop at first helped me understand Premiere Pro and After Effects more. Like it's the nice. basically the same UI system. One thing that I, lo I loved is that you, you, I clearly saw your videos improve in a very short space of time. Um, yeah. Do you have any examples of the videos that you used to make? Yeah, exactly. Well, let me share my screen. So this is the first, one of my first edits and I was following your course. And then this is a short thing. So let me play. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's actually not bad for some of the first edits. Yeah, but I was so dumb that I didn't add motion blur. Oh, right. Yeah, that not makes even a massive motion difference. Blur. <laughs> that makes a massive difference. I'm on your Instagram right now and yeah. you've got like uh, like footage from, I think it was uh, like Graveyard Works. Yeah, exactly. So is that the shots that were all? Yeah, so yeah, Graveyard Works. I mean, that edit is sick. That edit is so sick. Yeah, so you... I also was be beginner in that. Yeah, I mean, but they're, they're still pretty cool. So from that yeah, video yeah, exactly. where that you did through the course to now, like the jump has been ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. And you got very creative. So this one here, it's so it's so cool with the like. Um... It was so fast, though, and the footage of that wasn't too good. Like there did were you get the so footage? many clips, but only these were the good so short where did you get the clips from um else to be our books that's in oh okay that's a game. yeah of course this one's cool i like this one yeah yeah you did this like with so the that, yeah stuff. the ground effects from your video yeah what i realized a lot is um you start to understand kind of the the pacing of the mass yeah. transitions and the yeah, speed the, ramp. the movement yeah yeah, because usually people kind of go fast, 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 fast. Whereas you kind of come in fast, slow down, and then it speeds up yeah. to fast and then it slows down, which is what a lot of people struggle with. That had so much bad quality. I guess <laughs> I was experimenting with color grading and stuff. Oh, yeah? But that was a cre recreation from Jerry's audio. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They know the and then we got this one. <laughs> but in white, I didn't write. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's Sutra clips. Yeah, exactly. Nice, nice, nice. I I did another one on, on that uh, same audio and same. Oh, that's way better. Yeah. I remember. Yeah, I remember seeing this one. This is sick. Let's give that a like. Yeah. Oh, bro, the jump is massive. <laughs> <laughs> isn't it? Isn't it from this? Yeah, exactly. To that. The jump is yeah. massive. Yeah. And this one was for the editing comp. I thought it was really yeah, cool. Yeah, exactly. Did Can you do that on, 
on Cinema 4D or something? Um, Element 3D. Element, Element 3D, 3D, I thought it was so complicated and stuff, but there are so many tutorials on YouTube and it's just so easy for 3D text at least. Yeah, yeah. Dope. Yeah, this is sick. I like that yeah. one. It's great styling. Awesome, bro. What is the biggest advice you would give someone that is is starting out? I guess, in my personal opinion, um, starting with Photoshop and editing photos and getting to know the Adobe system and how it works in Photoshop, it will make it so much easier to learn video editing in Premiere Pro and After Effects. And after learning Photoshop, if you like, you can learn CapCut. It will also make it so much easier. And like CapCut, you won't get so much complicated and stuff and you'll like find found results uh, right away and you'll be motivated to learn Premiere Pro and After Effects. Right, that's quite smart. So you, you want someone to go on CapCut first so they can see the, the results of, yeah. of editing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. And that excites them to do Premiere Pro. That's really cool. I, I've never heard anybody yeah. say that. That's nice. Yeah, exactly. And yeah. watch Camellia's YouTube channel. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> that's sick, bro. What, what's your goal for this year? Your biggest goal? I would like to learn 3D animation and stuff and apply it in my videos. Well, yeah. bro, thank you so thank much, man. I, I think a lot of people Steve. are going to be inspired by your story. Yeah, thank you. Awesome.